I'm currently in the... I think I'm in the dining hall. Possibly. I think I'm in the dining hall. Oh shit. The He says keep alert, and I says I am alert. I've been alert. And he says yeah, but this time I really mean it. Hold on. What was that? Fuck. Something fishy in here. Don't know what it is. <laughs> okay. Wait. Where did I save? Did I save in a decent spot. Fuck. I saved in the worst possible place. Ah. Oh, now I gotta go all the way back out there. You know, was there still that guy over here? Or no? There was not. Okay. I like how she's just holding his torso like, hey. Okay. Well. Whoop! That's not... That's not how this was supposed to happen. Go here. And, uh, here. We demand the cure. As the blood fly concern gets worse, we are all waiting for a miracle miracle cure. The question is, how many more have to die in agony? Adamire's solution is good for a miner's woes. Enriched, it's been used to treat blood fly fever with some success. And Dr. Alexandria Hypatia has stated publicly that she can improve the formula. So where's the cure? What happened? Let me tell you, Duke Luca Abel shuttered the Admired Institute with Hypatia inside. She's a prisoner. There's only one explanation for this. It's quite plain that this precious remedy is not available to anyone but the Duke and his circle of rich cronies. It is my opinion that they intend to whittle down the impoverished to a manageable few. The Duke drink copious the Duke drinks copious amounts of Hypatia's cure while the rest of us perish. I wouldn't be surprised. My pouch. What should we do with the leftovers? So perhaps I do need to kill these folks in here. I used to feed them to the dogs, but I'm not allowed to go to the kennels anymore. Let's feed the rats. Like that. Times are hard enough without you getting bitter. When Adermeyer was open to the public, I was proud of what Cooking for the sick. Discussing recipes with Dr. Hypatia. Now I feel useless. I know. But as bad as things have gotten, it'd all be worse without a job. Hark, there she blows. Hark, there she goes. Look sharp, pull up alongside. Look sharp, we're in for a ride. Burning. Huh, it's a wonderful noise. What a pleasant noise it makes when she squishes that. Oh my god, all the noise I'm making though. Ragdoll into the ocean, that's fine. That's exactly what I wanted to happen.
the ragdoll. Ragdoll, though. Quick saving that. Continue on. I suppose... Something to be said about... This area? Anyone oh. here? Show yourself. Oh shit. Don't open this door. So You're kidding me. I hope that uh quick save was not too far. <laughs> you're limp. Maybe you're always limp. Okay, I think I murdered her. Yeah, I murdered her already. And then there's this guy that's out here. Shit, man. Okay, that's just not gonna work then. I'm gonna have to shoot him off the edge. I'm gonna have to shoot him off the edge. <clears throat> the other guy... Unless I can distract him with the other guy. I can probably distract him with the other guy, right? So, I'm gonna use this. Unlock this door. Close the oh my god. Okay, I can knock him off. But with a well-timed shot. Huh. Hit the wrong button. Fuck my life. This is what happens when you hit the wrong buttons in games. You just get detected. <laughs> Shut up, Chibi. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna get this right. We're gonna get this right. So he sees me leaning out. Holy oh, shit! <gasps> Someone tried to shoot me in the head. Well, this is wonderful. Someone tried to shoot you in the head, but it didn't kill you. How can I shoot you in the head and not die? Literally shoot you square between the eyes. And Never makes sense. It's like the third time this has happened where I've like shot someone and uh, it didn't die. Okay, I can't lean out for too long. Because on hard difficulty, it'll give me away. Oh. Helmets protect. Oh, yeah, the helmets, I guess. I mean, I feel like I hit him in the face, though, not on the helmet. Loosh. And he fell off somewhere. Okay, here he is. Oh, 
Oh my god, his head. <laughs> Did I, his head just... Okay. Chaos is high. There's a guy there. And I don't think there's another one there. Games. Stab. That mini harpoon probably clears the size of great. <laughs> Potentially, it is quite possible. Fuck that. Mm, crossbow bolts. Makes a splash. Doesn't make a splash noise, but makes a crashing noise. That is uh, wonderfully clever there. All right. Hey, can I actually talk to her for a moment? Cool. I guess there's nothing else for me to get here. All right. So now we can go. Through here, undetected. Gliding upstairs. Hey, Lou. Okay. And we're gonna do another quick save. Oh great! I'm glad I saved here because that is some bullshit. <laughs> That's some bullshit. Right there. Oh my god! Come on to shut up, Chibi, you fucker. You mother fucker. This is all Chibi's fault. Someone there. How? How? Oh my god. I was super quiet. I was super stealth. I don't understand. Can I just like... Maybe he has cursed this. He has cursed this playthrough. He has sullied my detection. No way, what? Oh, now suddenly you see a body? Was is that one of your friends suddenly seeing a body? Okay.
Is that much of a leg to stand on? Hard difficulty, not easy. Also, things provide less cover in two than one. Yeah, that's very true. Oh my god, I just like, I semi freaked out because I thought that, uh, there were blood flies a moment ago, and I, like, got very concerned. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Okay, you know what? I've, I've killed everybody outside. So, there has got to be a way to get down to fucking ruin. Blowing my mind. Not there. Perhaps there's something under the water. Whatever, let's just explore. Well, that is not quite what I meant when I said explore the water. But. Fucking hagfish, I wish I could just attack. Oh god, that creepy music. Oh, oh, okay, well. Game over. Oh god, we're six hours in? I mean, I mean six hours into the gameplay, like. I spent two hours in this place alone, like, there's so much shit. Alright. That room. Fucking swear. There's gotta be... Gotta be a way. Right? There's gotta be a way. Never get used to it. What? Where did those rats come from? No one knows what's happened. Could be anything. Uh, Just gotta watch my own back. Someone in a mask or something. Well, just wait till they see me. Fuck, man. I'm I'm looking for the rune right now. The the ever elusive rune that is on the bottom of the building. So it's the rune down here. There's just not really any clear-cut way to getting to it. Problem. Yeah, 
Clearly, Dr. Hypatia is not seeing patients anymore. I really want to keep the stealth. That's the problem. I want to murder them, but I want to keep the stealth aspect. The only really way I guess I could get by is not to... I mean, I guess I could just not murder that guy. I don't really necessarily know that... It's going to be possible to get by. Clearly, Dr. Hypatia is not seeing patients anymore. Yeah, I feel like maybe I'm getting closer, but that's still just fucking ridiculously far away. That's disappointing. He's over there. Trying to figure out Is he dead or he's very much alive. This is absolutely ridiculous at this point.
Alright. Don't see shit. Literally directly below me. Yeah, so it's it's right below me. I'm gonna try one more thing, and if I still can't figure that out, then I will just, uh, I'll take a hint. But I want to try something first. Uh... What the... what the hell? No, can I not? I can't... oh, fuck. What? The sense. Why... why you know... what? What is even happening? Oh, dear God. They lock when released or fully rotated. Yeah, that just sucks. So there's gotta be like... There's a crank reel... There. Like... Oh, there we go. Lock and release are fully rotating and cannot be turned again. Um. Oh, shit. So. There's a way to release this, I'm assuming. Some locked, uh, some lock when released or when fully rotated and cannot. Yeah, but the crank is, is, uh, not doing what it should. Doing very stupid things. Like, so I've got to lower it completely. But it won't lower it completely. So it's locked completely, and then I lower it, but it doesn't lower anything. Which is the most annoying thing ever about this. Crank it too much. Yeah, a uh, reminder, it is a blind playthrough. So no hints, no backseating. Oh, you know what? This can't be it. This makes literally zero sense. I mean, unless... Uh, 
I have no fucking clue. I don't have any powers that would freeze this. Grand Guard personnel, on orders from the Duke. Anyone discussing Adamar with non-authorized persons will be court-martialed and imprisoned. Well... The lack of, um... Yeah, go ahead and give me a hint for this rune, because this is ridiculous. Like, just a, just a hint, like, as to how to kind of get to the area. I'm, I'm accepting a hint for this one little thing, so I can just keep moving. That's what I thought. The only problem is um, the elevator's a little bitch. Oh my god. I thought it was the elevator and I tried doing that and I don't think it would let me go down as far as I wanted to. Get back up there. Get back up the top. There we go. You know what? I know how to get there now. I think I know how to get there. That's not... No, that's not it. And that region on the mana, though. Something seems wrong here. Oh my gosh, just let me out. Oh my Jesus. So much about this makes zero sense. And then reload because it's, uh, I'll have some of my, my elixir back. Whatever the fuck they call it. The solution, so that way I can recover more of. Powers again. 
Oh shit, nope. Not where I need to be. Oh my. I could rage real hard right now. Here we go. Through here. Back through here. Nothing interesting in here. Try them this more time. Jump and climb in. Right? Welcome back, dude. We must. Seems like not quite the thing I need to do. I'm just gonna save this here. And then, if what I think is happening is not, is, uh, comes true, then I just won't bother. I don't know what's pushing this. Right? And then there's something below. None of this makes any sense. Yeah, I hate doing- I hate being sick too, it really sucks. None of this any sense, the stupid elevator is some bullshit. Oh my lord. Can I do what I- Maybe- Okay, I can't- I can't go that way. The wires, I'm assuming, like, I guess, but... Oh, you know what? Yep. There we go. Thanks, <laughs> thanks, Scarecrow. Oh, that was like that was like annoyingly. I feel like I spent like a good thirty minutes on that. I'm really hoping that uh, they're not all out there. That would not be pleasant. That'd be pretty terrible. Crow saves the day. <laughs> if they're all Aggie in here, I'm gonna be real upset with you. If they're all in the middle of the fucking area, I'm telling you right now. Murder you?
Oh shit, the door? They broke the door? What the fuck? Okay. Oh, do I literally have to just fall through the top? Seeing as the button did not work. Can't open the doors from the outside anymore, only inside. Of course. Well, then I'll just load that again. Oh fuck, I saved- oh fuck me. That is slightly obnoxious. So... Let's just quick save this. I'm assuming... That I can, like... Or, or I just died in my- I just fall to my death as well. That's also fine. I just fall- let me just fall straight to my death. Was I supposed to ride in the elevator as it was falling? Uh, I mean, I, it kind of like broke. I guess it's irretrievable now. That's really disappointing. Because I pushed the button, so then now I don't think it's going to open up. Oh, fuck it. That is ridiculous. Okay. How far back am I going to go to that autosave? That's going to be an hour back. How much progress? There wasn't too much that I... I mean, I, I didn't get anything else. Let's just load this. Uh, what do I need to do here? If I can always have that autosave. I'm gonna close this. And now I have this again. That's there. I'm gonna just overwrite quick save. Because now I have a hard save in the same area with the same predicament. Which literally is like. Oh dear god. Uh, through here. 
now. Okay, that was what I was supposed to do. I was supposed to I was supposed to stay in the elevator as I fell down here. I'm tired. How long, my dears? How long must I endure in this shadow state? I miss being Ooh, there's a painting down here. Vera Mori's belongings, second day, month of seeds, 1810. Gus, seems like our VIP guest, Miss Vera Moray, has finally flown round the bend. She's been sent to critical observation area, getting cold showers everywhere, three hours and the like. I heard one of the doctors say she might have contracted some nameless disease on an expedition to Pandicia, another eccentric aristocrat trying too hard to live a life beyond us ordinary folk. Another, uh, so anyway, some of the stuff was still in her room, so I'll store it all lost and found down in the basement until she sent back to her husband. He is in for a nice surprise, considering how she spends her time now talking to herself and carving obscenities into pieces of bone. Just remember to give everything back to her when she checks out. Done it twice and never rode the elevator. So how have you done it? Have you literally just gone down and like just fallen down the shaft? Because I feel like that is just that's what led to my death. I, I mean, I, I don't see any other way to get down there. Uh, 12th month of high cold. My phys uh, physician says I should keep a journal, says it will do me good to reflect on my ways and my deeds. Does that the mark on my hand is just a tattoo or blemish from birth, and that the black-eyed boy is the only is only in my head. Sha, a bunch of fools. I found where the administrator keeps the whiskey. Snuck a bottle back to my room. Easy as that. I think I could stuff a whale under my jacket and dance the gavotte, and they'd never notice. What would my sweet physician say about that? My dreary old husband. Oh, my Vera, what have you done now? Mumble, mumble. Appearances and whatnot. Sixteenth month of hearts. Of hearts. I must get home to my collection of carved bones. Such pretty things. Brought all the way from Pendicia. How warm they feel in my hands. This power there. Something I could learn to harness. That's why I've been trying to be a proper lady again. Clean nails and a perfumed handkerchief. A physician says, if I'm still behaved by the end of hearts, that they might send me home. So I smile and curtsy. And I ask for tea in the afternoon. Comb my hair. Drink my medicines. And I stopped trying to bite the attendants. <laughs> Things on the back of the elevator shaft, you can stand on them. Uh, so you care. Hmm. You know, that's what I was trying to do, and then I just fell, and I was just like, okay. Hopefully you're powerless when you stood on them and just shot the elevator cord. I don't know what you're dealing with. of a bitch. Alright, so we found that. Let's get this other bone charm. Times are harder 
going on here? That, Stop! That's not right. Ah. Uh, boo. That was such a good kill, too. Fuck. I, I teleported through. Nobody saw me. And it was it was perfect, you know, it was it was absolutely amazing. I don't know why um Don't know why it happened like that, and that is very annoying. Just won't let me live, huh? That was a very disappointing thing. At least I have all my elixir back, so. Rip. Your life. I feel slightly bad. I only feel a slight twinge of regret. I gotta get back to Dunwall. I feel so bad. Stab. All right, back to the action again. And then we can go find Hypatia, somehow figure out how to get through that blood fly bullshit, and then, um, yeah. Exacting aim is that. The crossbow bolts inflict slightly more damage. Oh. Mm, Undertaker. Okay. That's nice. Alright, so now I'm assuming the rest are going to be in that wonderful place that is the recuperation area. This one like directly above. The corrupt bone charm is six meters away. Elemental E. Just once, I'd now I got my just once. Tell me what you're Okay. Can I take this? Yes, I can. Sir Fuck that guy. I need to start paying attention to the paintings again. I keep forgetting that the paintings can be looted, depending on what they look like. Keep forgetting about that. So now I need to go upstairs. I almost forgot that that guy was there. That guy and his hound friends. So the corrupt room is rune is there. Seemed like something moved. Tension off. That were no blue jawed hagfish. River crust is more likely. Listen, I'm on and become a hairdresser.
I don't think this has anything to do with what I think it does. That corrupted charm, though. Walks away just to go back to the Sabiano. I feel like I heard something move, but I just don't know what. Like... don't know. I have no idea how to get there. There doesn't seem to be any kind of, like, hint as to how to get that bullshit open. That's frustrating. That's fucking frustrating. Nothing behind there. You know what? It's probably in recuperation. But how would it be? Because that wouldn't make any sense. Unless it's like air. I'm literally just trying to be thorough, so I don't have to come back to these same areas. Wasn't I just there? Was I not just in that same place? This is so frustrating. Okay. I feel like I literally just came from there. I feel like that was the same exact room. Yeah, it's the same room. Donnery, what's going on? How are you doing? You got your PS4 today? Nice. Where the fuck is this rune? Why can't I get to this rune? This is pissing me off so bad. Fuck it. I don't even really care about it right now. That's like 10... That's super annoying. That's in such a shitty place. And none of that makes any sense. So whatever. Let's just go probably on the other side through these wonderful blood fly infested building areas so mm, I'm gonna quick save this well save regularly <sighs> this is gonna suck balls because now I gotta be precise this is twisted This is all types of fucked up. Fringe level. That chloroform bottle? And I don't really know how that's gonna help me. 
Oh, fucking, I, I hate these fucking things so damn much. So after this, this is a uh, no more no more hints. Oh god, this shit is fucking Oh dear god. Fuck you guys. God, man. So it's all about, like, basically just fucking off. <laughs> Apparently. Oh, they're so creepy. They're so creepy. They're so, so creepy. Okay. Un incendiary bolts were at my feet the entire time. What's up? Please stay the fuck there. Oh. Fuck you guys. Holy shit, man. These guys are this, these guys are so fucking disturbing. Just don't get reckless. I mean, you know, it worked all those other times. So okay, like the ones that are a very important thing to note, the ones that are glowing are still active. The other ones have been abandoned or are dormant and have been taken care of. So that is good to know. Oh, this level of creep. Bourbon Rum? I fucking hate these things so much. Oh. Fuck you guys, man. Oh, that is fucked up, man. Oh my god, that body is like a fucking nightmare. Get out of the way. Stop trying to attack me, you fucks. Fuck that. That is so gross. Oh my god. The level of disgust. Like, I don't think you understand, man. Oh my god, that is just fucking. Yeah, Downery, like, okay, see, Red Mage gave me shit for that, right? Red Mage gave me a hell of a lot of shit for cringing during all of these parts. And I just can't fucking, like, it's so disgusting. Like, I hate it so much. Oh, fuck me. The door is blocked by these fucking pieces of shit. Oh my god. Poke the body? I did. I poked it in this fucking gut. Like, that's fucking disgusting, man. That's what they do to your body when they murder you? Like, that's fucked up. Like, the rat plague was already fucked up, because, you know, rats eating your face off. Rats eating your face off is one thing, but, like, this is a whole new level of fucking crazy. This is a whole new level of crazy 
and I'm not so sure that I'm okay with it. I'm very not alright with it. Oh my god. Please tell me there are more bottles somewhere. I only have one more <laughs> round of an incendiary bowl. That's I only have one more. Just literally one. Ugh, so creepy. Stick your finger in a hole in the body. That's probably a terrible idea. You know, I'm not trying to become a larva infestation. Are these? Uh, <clears throat> the level of fucked up shit in this game. Like, this is... Mm, I just can't fucking... Oh my god. Okay, well I saved. I wonder if I try to like... Are these explosives? They are not. I wasted a round and I'm not trying to have shit come after me. This is... Oh my god. Where the fuck did you guys come from? Get out of here. Get the, get the fuck out of here. Fuck off. Flying pieces of shit. Uh, so grossed out. Alright, I need to save that one. But I need to deal with the ones in here. Right? Oh, that could have been handled a little better. Let me go back. So there were more f uh, flammable bottles. I just have to, like, cringe the entire time as I hunt them down. And this is not cool. This is not cool. Yo, fuck off. Fuck out of here. Fuck out of here. Fuck Ah, That's creepy. Ugh, oh, it's, like, swarming around me. That's fucking disturbing. Stop trying to make my body lava, larva, like stop that. Stop it right the fuck now. Stop flying around me. Oh, it's so creepy. Okay. Yeah, actually that's what I have uh, for my games right now. I use a hybrid drive for all my Steam games. I put them on there. But then I also, I think I also use this uh, hybrid drive for my, um, I think I also used a hybrid drive for my PS4 when I got the terabyte. This is gonna be difficult. Fuck, man. What? Oh my gosh, my aim. This, the aim, the aim, the aim was so terrible. Where did they just come out of one? Oh my god. Hey, hey, hey. You stop that. Did they just come out of the one that I did not explode? Just please. Please, blood flies, please. Blood flies, please. Blood flies, please. Stop that. You stop. You stop being creepy. Okay? No one has time for your shit. You're buzzing all in my ear and like I just can't. Can't fucking deal. I could I could really I I need you to cut it. Nobody's coming near you. It's fine. Everything's fine. 
Everything's okay. Raw whale bone. Oh god. They fly around when the hive is gone. Yeah, they're fucking disturbing. I just wish they would go away. You're so fucking creepy, man. Like I said, I normally don't mind bugs, but I do mind, like, when they make them super over the top, fucking disturbing like this. It's just the lore behind it, like, it's just creepy. The lore is, like, super creepy, and everything about it is terrible and awful. Like, the fact that you, you die, and then they just, like, infest your body is just... Oh, okay. I guess we don't... we don't want to do that? Okay. I think Ibisha has lost her fucking mind. Why would you want to, like... oh my god. She's probably become, like, a nest, uh, a nest keeper at this point. There's no way that she's survived this. You know, I'm pretty sure. Where's the nest? Die already! Die! Die! Fuck! <sighs> They're so cringeworthy. Such cringe, much bleh. Okay, exacting aim, ground glider. Let's switch that one out for whatever this one was. Assassination some Oh it restores health it restores health because the other one I had was Falling Star. That's the other one I had. Yeah, let's do that one. That was worth it. Still fucking cringy, but it was worth it. My health is maxed, so. <clears throat> so now we have just the corrupted bone charm left. Right? Is that it? That is literally all. So I um, I will apologize if the the gameplay has seemed a little slow right now, but I am kind of a completionist, so I do like to go through uh most games and get everything I can. Oh, that's where this is. Okay. So we're gonna save this. Oh my god, this is gross. Why does this have to be so gross? Why does- why must this be so gross? Why must we- why must we resort to such gross things? Like my skin is crawling. Talk to Hypatia. Are you a patient of mine? 
I'm sorry. I... I should know that. I'm here to ask you about something. Do you cover your face because you were hurt? The afflictions we treat here are more common than anyone likes to admit. I'm not here for treatment. I'm looking for Anton Sokolov. Sokolov? Yes, he was here for a short time. But she took him away. To see Kirin Jindosh. Do you... Do you hear something? What about the Crown Killer? The patient of yours? The Crown Killer? That name came from the newspapers. <clears throat> I'm afraid I don't... Oh yes, the murders. I was in Dunwall, studying diseases found among whaling crews. Wait, did someone just call me? I've been forgetting things. The Crown Killer is an interesting case. I feel almost sure I could help with that. It's just... I used to do Oof. such good oh, work that's and gross. my memory is failing me. Who is that calling me? Excuse me. Is she working for the Outsider? Is the outsider in her mind? Because I feel like the outsider is like fucking with her brain. <clears throat> Makes me want to experiment on my enemies. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> is that. <laughs> that's what High Chaos does? That's what the High Chaos answer says? I Makes me want to experiment on my enemies? My oh my god, again. okay. Alright. What was I working with? <laughs> Emily's that evil. Time, perhaps. I'm totally fine with this level of evil for Emily. Everything is okay with this. She'd be nuts. <laughs> I mean, hey, Emily is like slowly getting to that chaos. Body's dead. Oh, that is disgusting. Oh, they're in the. Oh, okay. I was so like, I was so stressed out for like a hot moment because I thought that um, I was going to have to deal with more blood flyness, and I just did not feel like dealing with that. Power slash. What is power slash? You deal greater damage with your sword. Your sword attacks are slower. I'm fine with that. So, what can I get rid of? I guess I could get rid of... No, I want to keep that. Let's get rid of Undertaker for a power slash. Where attacks are slower. Why not? Uh, Crown Killer Rampage continues. Wherever there are opponents of Empress Emily Colwyn, so follow the ghastly deeds of the Crown Killer. The first victims were citizens of Kanaka, most notably Corey Brockburn, one of the earliest to so openly criticize the young Colwyn. Just a month after the passage of her Sharecropper Rights Act, Brockburn urged Parliament and Gristol to hold a vote for no confidence. He never ceased to scrutinize the decree from Dunwall Tower, attacking each with the same ferocity. After Brockburn's terrible death, several more fell in Karnaka, always old foes of the Colvin family, including Janice Tynes, the former editor of Karnaka Gazette. A week after her scathing editorial called Emily an empress in name only, there was, uh, Tynes was found dead in her office, missing several limbs that were never recovered. Then murders spread to other parts of the empire. Dozen, dozens have now been taken, with the latest being Ichabod Boyle, a respected businessman from Dunwall, who founded the Anti-Rationing Club to protest recent imperial decrees on the distribution of whale oil. Terrible killings. So much blood. Unmine. So much meat. <laughs> you did well finding Anton Sokolov, my friend. The old man is with Kirin Jindas, who is prying him Why apart. are you so damn timid, you so little mouse? Who knows what wonders of natural philosophy Jindash will reveal in future days. But it's time for you to come out. I would take hold of your tongue and pull it from your head if I could. We have need for your special talents. The good doctors do for a trip to Dunwall because Ichabod Boyle is next on the list. Make haste. 
The next one. The next one. Dried nails between his toes. Uh, Dumbo Citizens is fresh shock and furious. Yet another outspoken critic of Emily Colvin has met with a violent demise. Uh, this is the same thing. Oh, Ikaba Boyle, notable entrepreneur and supporter of the arts. No, I already read this. This was from the very beginning of the game. Like, near the beginning of the game. Now there's an idea, an elixir, that will keep them alive after my nest flies in their guts. Okay. What is in here? Find Vasco? The outsider doesn't do anything in his. The outsider doesn't do anything. Doesn't mean that he, you know, doesn't encourage it. Doesn't mean he's not entertained by it. He is so fucking insane. Wow, this lady. This lady. Objective eliminate the crown killer. Uh, the crown killer who's making, the murdering your enemies make you feel guilty, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Are you, are you all right? <laughs> Dr. Hypatia did this. She's the crown killer. But she's not herself. She d developed a serum trying to help the miners. The first version caused horrible changes to her mind. <clears throat> it's too late for me, but maybe you can still save her. She's a good person. What can I do? In my safe, in disease treatment, you'll figure out how to make the counter serum help her help her the safe code is 488 oh my god i don't miss what your flesh tastes like my dear assistant um She's gone. What happened? Kill the crown killer or find the journal. She has lost her fucking mind. Oh, there she is. He is a nest keeper. I'm hungry. They promised me another muscle gardener from the Grand Palace. for all the necks you snapped. Crazy bitch. <laughs> She's real dead. Stealth killed. Holy fuck, what in the hell, lady? Um... Miss. Excuse me. Excuse me. What are you... What are you... Okay.
Jack's nothing like a nest keeper like that. <laughs> yeah. She just fucking lost her damn mind. That's what the fuck happened. She is just fucking insane is what she is. She's got all types of issues. Oh, I hate this so much. There's not e it's not even threatening in here anymore and I'm already cringing. Like I'm already creeped out. I'm just creeped and uncomfortable. I'm like my s there's like chills up my spine. Good god, good god. Like good job devs. Just good job. You have sufficiently creeped the fuck out of me playing this game in ways that Dishonored 1 could never creep me out. Like even the river. Oh, I'm sure it's nothing. Someone just heard a dog bark or something. Oh! Yeah, that's totally what it was. Dog bark. He did. Leveling, gotta go. Uh, leaving, have fun with the fuck things. <laughs> All right, take it easy, Reese. Rest well. See you again soon. Oh, damn it. I forgot about his little friend over here. Um... I suppose this autosave is what I want. There's no place for monsters like you in my empire. Definitely not. We must return to the dreadful way. I was checking out how upgrading the PS4 HD works and the prices. Uh, there was a. If you look on Amazon, you can catch them on pretty decent sales. Like, there was one that, uh. I think I got. Well, the one I got was kind of expensive, but it was on sale at the time at Best Buy. And that was the last purchase I actually legit got from Best Buy because. Buck there, only 14 day. I'll see. But, um. There was a really nice one that I got from them. I think it was like the Seagate brand. Or maybe that was like for my desktop. Okay, so then, like the one that I got for my PS4, I got, um. I got it from Amazon, I believe. And it was the Seagate brand uh, hybrid drive. Let me, let me pick him up. Let me quick save this. Son of a bitch. Shit. 
shit. Damn it. <laughs> Come on. That was a perfect drop assassination leading into the perfect opportunity to murder the hell of his friend. Okay. Or I guess we can do that too, which is not what I wanted. But okay. I guess we can just do that as well. Nice. Two terabyte, uh, one for 89. You know, I think that is the one that I got. I, I don't think I got the one terror. Well, did I? It might be cheaper. Damn. Of course. Suddenly you see me here, even though you didn't see me here before. Level of frustration with that. Okay. Oh, sure, yeah, he knows how to talk with the boss. Like spittle. No. <sighs> What's going on here? Stop! Okay, new plan. Plan is... Shoot that guy, and then while the other guy's distracted with his death, murder that guy. So shoot him from around the bin, if I can do this correctly. Huh? <laughs> By the boy! I was close! What? What's going on here? Nobody there. Who that was? Something's wrong. Hard times. Hard times. Gotta be on the lookout. <sighs> Hello? Anybody? Don't make me search the whole place. I don't have time for that. I want to shadow murder you, because you especially pissed me off. Did I ever turn off the overhead? I did not.
What? Oh, that's such bullshit. Okay. So perhaps, um, Damn PS4 wasn't made to hold a two terabyte. So you got the original one? I don't know, it might, it might be able to, well, it wasn't intended to, but it would probably be okay. I'm not quoting that 100%, like, I'm not saying 100% that it will be fine, but I'm assuming that it won't be no, too much of an issue. I'm sure it's nothing. Someone just heard a dog. Of course, now we're all on edge. Perhaps I just shoot you, like, on the neck. That's not what I meant to do, but that's funny to see. I meant to shoot him with the other one, not make him go insane. Sorry, I'm fucked up. I'm so... Okay, I'm such a terrible person. I shouldn't have laughed at that. That was kind of funny, though. It's just like they all just explosion of bullshit. Are you the only one down there? Cause I'm gonna face. I'm gonna fucking stab you in the face. Oh, you did. Okay. Yeah. Bye. Alright, let's grab some stuff in here. Oh, I can't grab anything else. Yeah, I'm pretty done. I am pretty much finished here. Uh, powers. I have four runes. Okay, really? Okay. Okay. If aiming uh, far reach while falling, time slows, allowing you more to move with more precision. <clears throat> Turn unaware enemies to ash as they die. Do shadow kill. Transform his enemies killed in combat into blood flies as they die. That's gonna be fucked up. Um. Decelerate. Aiming far reach while falling, time slows, allowing you to move with vision. Or I could increase the shadow attack. Hmm. Let's go for two shadow cut. Perhaps. Or I 
No, I want I want more I want more mobility for right now. Let's go with more mobility, especially since like there's so much um There's literally so much going on there. Show tutorial. What's That would be like a little video or something, which would have been cool. So yeah. Let's try that. Oh, okay. I'm gonna try that again. I just wanna get like a good idea of how it's gonna work. Oh, yep, that's nice. <laughs> I mean, let's not do like that. But... Let's load the autosave so I don't murder myself. That is, a, that is a very noticeable difference, though, which is good. That's a very, very good thing to have. So, let's go back here. Alright, and it auto-saved it for me. Cool, so now I have shadow kill, so any unaware enemies turn to ash. So no more bodies. Which is really gonna help. We're gonna save this. Sokolov's out there somewhere. Can we leave this place yet? I don't like it. Ready now? Yes. Go to the whale. Let's get back to the ship. You didn't find Sokolov. No. But I killed Hypatia. You what? She was the crown killer. The Duke tricked her into injecting herself with a flawed version of her serum. It changed her. She wasn't even aware of it. What about Anton? They gave him to a man named Kieran Jindosh. Do you know who that is? Everybody knows him. The grand inventor of Sirkonos. And who's next? Alright. So my overall chaos level was high. Amount of stealth, perfect. But I murdered the fuck out of everybody. <laughs> um, I didn't kill any civilians, I just killed the hostiles, so that helps. I didn't ring any alarms, I only got one body detected, and then I was never detected myself, so that works. I got all the runes, all the well most- wow, only half of the coins, what? Oh shit, I don't think I picked- fuck, man. I think I- I don't, I don't think I picked up the blueprint that was on Hypatia's desk, did I? Oh well. That's disappointing. And I saw it, too, in the middle of the cutscene, and I just forgot all about it. <laughs> saw it in the middle of the cutscene. Straight up just was like... Just forgot. I just totally forgot, you know? Great. In his day... Sokolov was Dunwall's genius. His inventions transformed the city. I watched from the tower as they changed the capital into a prison. And listened as he drank and laughed, telling my mother time and again how brilliant he was. After her death, Sokolov's inventions helped a tyrant take control of the Empire. Now, all these years later, Kieran Jindosh is Karnaka's genius. The mad inventor who's given the Duke sinister machines that move like people but aren't. Clockwork soldiers that fight and kill. I've got to find out where Sokolov's being held and bring the old man back alive. Rescue one genius and kill the other before he creates an army of clockwork soldiers. Alright, 
You gotta talk to... We've talked to Megan Foster already? No, we meet, we meet with her now. Uh, Mises is very well. That's just a lot to read. Write the travel log. Crown Killer is no more next Jindosh. I finally uncovered how my enemies created the, count, the Crown Killer. Duke of Bell poisoned Alexandria Hypatia with her own serum. Horrible. Anyway, I put an end to it. Hypatia's dead now, and the Crown Killer died with her. She was a brilliant alchemist, but the monster was a part of her. Sokolov wasn't at Edermeyer Institute, but I was able to find out where he's been taken. Kirin Jindosh's mansion. Another natural philosopher. Professional jealousy? I think it's more than that, and it makes me very worried. Jindosh is the inventor of the Clockwork Soldier. I've seen his killing machines in action at Dunwall Tower, and I can't allow the Delilah to have such an ally. The Dreadful Whale. What a weird name. It's hard to sleep on the ship, and when I do, my dreams are troubled. Um, well, I'm awake now. I'm thinking about Sokolov. I remembered him at Hound Pit's pub. So long ago, trapped like a beast in a cage, he smelled of stale piss and rotting meat. They couldn't break him. He held on to himself and picked up again as my tutor, something I needed in the aftermath of my mother's death. Beware of dignitaries bearing gifts, he used to tell me, but I was still a child and I liked gifts. I thought nothing sounded more pleasant. Now I know better. I also find myself thinking of Callista, my old governess. She always wanted to travel the world on a big boat. Eventually she left Dunwald and stopped writing a few months later. Esther Coins, I did miss a painting. Yeah, that's what I thought. I need the rune that allows you to watch the faces of those who bow the most deeply or some such. I need to find the rune that allows me to uh, recover mana with uh, with water. Why do so many have so little? It was never meant to be this way. It's time to go get Sokolov. Lord the Skiff. There's nothing left in here. Here we are. That's a really fucking beautiful uh, coastline though, that's for sure. Ready? It reminds me almost of uh, Con France a little bit. You walked by the painting a lot from what I could tell. Damn. Feels bad. Alright, let's go. Alright, let's get underway. The Clockwork Mansion. Anton Sokolov is being held at the mansion of Kirin Jindosh, grand inventor to the Duke and the creator of Clockwork Soldier. Get inside, rescue Sokolov, and eliminate Jindosh before he builds an army of Clockwork Soldiers. Jindosh is important to the Duke's inner circle. The Grand Guard watches his mansion, and they'll call down the entire city if they find out who you are. I'll make sure they don't. You said there's a wall of light cutting off access to the carriage station? Yes, but there's a black market shop nearby. They sell on the sly. Ever use a rewiring tool? Corvo taught me the theory. Good. Get past the wall of light, then ride the carriage to where Jindosh lives. And there's a reason people are afraid of his mansion. I'll get it done. Hmm. I'm gonna take care of this crazy man and his clockwork soldiers, then bring Sokolov back. He means a lot to me. Ooh, rats. Get a rewire tool at the black market shop. How many coins do I have? Oh, I don't really have that much, honestly. Oh yeah, yeah. If um, once I actually 
beat this on Emily, like if I do another Emily run, uh, we can definitely discuss what I missed on her. I'm assuming Corvo is a completely different story, so I do want to kind of remain blind with that unless I'm completely stuck and need help. Nothing here? Nothing there? Okay. Black Market Shop is there. This is the Duke. Just a blow from a dream. A terrible red wave was rising up from the... Clockwork Mansion, High Ocean. Chaos. Coming to smash Carnegie. Hey, my job to check out my screen. It fell out of bed. It's not common knowledge, but traveling by ship horrifies me. It's unnatural. The ocean is a malignant force exists to drive us mad or drag us down deep, where our skin and organs turn to jelly and our bones settle in the muck. For those poor fools who make their trade on the waters, I wish... Is this hostile territory? This is hostile Shaconis territory. is a land of tall timber, fierce winds, and deep silver mines. Beat the ocean for those with no other choice. Blade Ballet. What is that? Spring Razors have a slight chance of eliminating a body. Oh shit. Also, the uh, Kirin is a little bit creepy. Like, like, super creepy. Level of creep is... Where is this other one at? Let's keep out. But the best place is to say keep out. They always, they always have the good things in there. That's why it's keep out. Oh shit, there's like, yeah, there's two of them here again. I'll tell you a story about Kirin Jindosh, the Duke's grand inventor. Once he was commissioned to make a toy for a six year Tivian noble girl. Jindosh worked for three months and built a machine composed of wood, brass, and the bones of several cats. It ran on a few drops of whale oil a day. The little girl was told she would have a special treat, and she was perfectly delighted until the moment it was activated. She lives in an asylum up at Dabakfa now, and will until the end of her days. Well, that's pleasant. Thank you so much for that. Okay. Let's acquire some powers here. Uh, we have two. So... Next thing that I want to get... Is probably... Domino is probably a good one. No, actually... Because, uh... Let's do Shadow Walk. Shadow Walk with two enemies. Incapacitated or assassinated. That's a good one. Okay. Man, 
the things I do for the bone charms, though. Yeah, I figured. I figured they wouldn't be as dark. Uh, Eggs, what's going on? How are you doing? Well, that's not what I meant to do, but okay. But yeah, I figured that. I figured it wouldn't be quite as dark uh, in certain places. Oh, Jesus. Holy shit, that's a lot of them. Mm, she's about to die. Oh my god, I just wasted my last bullet. That was terrible. Let's do this again. Oh, level creep. Oh, I hate dealing with them. So it's already seeming to be a lot of... So I think when it's saying that a lot of blood flies, it's saying that there's going to be an increased amount. So like a whole lot more. Get out of here. Oh dear god. That's a whole bunch, man. Jesus. I'm going to do a separate save on the off chance that this is a terrible decision. God. They're so terrible. I'm not even getting like anything worthwhile from them either. I'm not even getting any of the blood amber. Where the fuck is the blood amber? Could you imagine playing this on fucking very hard? I'd be immediately wrecked. Like I'd be immediately ripped. Everything would just murder the fuck out of me. These blood flies would just kill me in seconds. is waiting. Why do I feel like I didn't even need to go through this to get that rune? Well, not the rune, the bone charm.
Okay, well, I just went into a blood uh, fly nest for no other reason. Maybe getting blood amber? I guess the only way to get the blood amber would be for me to actually, like, blow it up. Set it on fire. So, uh... Okay, I mean, like, it's fine, because I had a good amount of health. The bone charm is there. Well, this works. Uh, lots of random people down there. Seems like it should be relatively neutral, but it's not quite. Wishing noises. <clears throat> okay, Sokolov. We were only miles from shore, but approached um, our approach was marred by numerous hidden reefs and jagged rocks. They lay shallow, and we spied two vessels that had succumbed to them some time ago. The remaining crew were was uncharacteristically silent as we edged by the weathered wrecks. The first mate declared a particularly narrow channel to be impassable, but the, cap the captain dispatched ten crewmen onto the submerged coral with sledgehammers. Thereafter, each chest deep in water, they pulled the Antonia Al Aquio into the tiny channels with rope. It proved a marvelous solution. However, just as we were about to lower the rope ladders, tragedy struck. As the men were beset by a school of reef-dwelling eels, Apparently their toxic bites were quite painful. From the railing, we could see them swarming the men who begged us for aid before succumbing to the paralytic effects of the toxin. Within moments, we all were still in water. We continued on in silence, and by sunset, we had cleared the bars and put an anchor in a bay with a red rock beneath an emerald overgrowth beyond. I confess I was nearly giddy to put my feet on land again. The smell of ripening fruits and warm earth was as pleasing to me as cherished vintage. We gathered wood and made fires, and indulged in some tinned meat and lemons from our stores. How good was it to slumber on the beach with the crackle of embers nearby? Having finally escaped the cramped and damp quarters of our vessel, we took turns with the watch and passed a quiet night. At last, we stood appendicine, on Pandician soil. Okay. Black bone charm is in here. Oh god, that's fucking creepy. New bone charm, what was it? Expensive spirit. Maximum mana is increased. The Rome family restores health. Power slash doesn't really do much for me since I'm stealth. Fancy spirit is nice. Ooh, that's fancy. Blood Amber is random. If not using powers, you'd have to walk up that way. Oh, that's pleasant. I bet that was wonderful for you when uh, you had to do the no power high chaos run. All of the fucking blood flies. It seems like what you're supposed to do is walk very slowly and not get no close to the nest. Because when you get close to the nest, that's when they fuck you over. God, they're so gross, like, who would want to keep a sample of that? That is so... <clears throat> That's so many levels of fucked up that I can't even describe. Oh... Yeah, let's eat a carrot in the, you know, dining hall 
full of fucking human meat and shit. That's that's a good idea. That is a wonderful idea. I keep wondering, like, if the rats are gonna attack me when I'm not paying attention, which is why I, like, stop a moment. Because I'm like, are they going to attack me? Because I'd rather them not. When the Grand Guard go into the place and see it packed solid with blood flies, they burn the building to the ground. And the ones on either side. They may just smoke flash it. Either way, the jewels will be ruined. We're not getting our money, are we? Have some faith. It'll just be more complicated than I thought it would be. The Dukes let the blood flies get out of hand this year. Am I ever gonna catch a break? Nobody's looking out for nobody right now. We'll go back tonight and dig the jewels out. After that, we'll make a quick exit. Why someone want to sample that? Me either. I don't understand. That's really gross. I miss the time when I could go to sleep without wondering if I'd wake up. I doubt I can help you. Whatever you want. Well, fuck you too, lady. Well, there has to be enough. Yeah, that's right. So now there's not enough together yet. I I worry about the rats reassembling. Keep the dust out. Yeah, you didn't see that. There's got to be like an angle that I can get to that will allow me to grab this thing. Here we go. Okay. Creighton, what's going on? How are you doing? We'll go back tonight and dig the jewels out. After that, we'll make a quick exit from Karnaka. We're playing dice tonight. Are you in? You there! I need your help! You up for a beer later? <sighs> You there! I need your help! <sighs> I bet my last coin is gonna be Brian Hagfish again. You there! I need your help! Oh wait, did I just like... Do you need my help, or are you trying to, like... We'll go back tonight and dig the jewels out. After that, we'll make a quick exit from Karnaka. You there! I need your help! Thank you! Mm-hmm. You crazy bitch. That's what I thought. Ready for a first take of work on the farm? <laughs> nice! We'll go back tonight and dig the jewels out. After that, hey guys. we'll make a quick exit from Karnaka. Just minding my own business, trying to get by. You there? I need your help. Year later. <sighs> no, not this time. Coming tonight. Maybe I should have it looked at. 
I don't think it's supposed to fester like that. Oh, look, this is all right. Fuck y'all. And they all turn to ash. End of Grey River. Gil, you screwed me. Paolo was supposed to be here. I was where you said he'd be alone. We knifed him 50 times. He was choking blood when I drove a rail spike through the side of his head. And he was gone. And then there were nothing but a bunch of rats. Not sure how he pulled that trick, but he must have known, scumbag. Next day, Paolo came with ten howlers. Got a couple of got us a couple at a time. Dragged Brenda and Thomas screaming into the street, and then bashed all their teeth in with a hammer. With that crazy powder in their eyes, had them seeing terrible things, screaming like carnival clowns. Mouths all red and red. And Paolo gave the word, and they shot him um, with those screaming darts they used. I stayed hid. I'm finished, asshole. And I bet you were working with the howlers all along. I swear, if I ever see you again, I'll stick you, Sabine. Let's see what else we can do. No more stealth? <laughs> no, that was stealth. We're still doing stealth. I reloaded. I did stealth, I just didn't let them see me. I was not detected. Now, if you're talking about stealth as in like, no bodies being seen, fuck that, because that's just too much. <laughs> Getting paid half of your wage, he said, welcome gift, nice. Oh. What's up? You're not slick. What's going on? You're not... You're not slick at all. Where can I go? Uh... Can I, like, land on there? Someone should have come through already. Right. Tip off the mark. How long are we gonna wait for some lost aristocrat to stumble through? Long as it takes. You wanna eat, right? Maybe this ain't such a good spot for an ambush. God's shaking people down. More blood flies this year. People just ain't walking the streets anymore. Getting hard to make a decent living. Yeah, bitches. Fuck y'all. Murdered your shit. A rune or a bone charm nearby? No, there's gotta be something close. Yep. And a quick save here. Here we go. Oh shit. Oh, fucking son of a bitch. I'm, uh... This is not at all what I wanted.
damn it, I need to pee. I'm bored. The hairs on the back of my neck are tingling. I gotta... Think of the far reach compared to Blink, I think. They both have their own huge, they have their own advantages. So Blink has the advantage of, you know, exactly, knowing exactly where you're gonna land and you don't have to, you don't have to guesstimate where you're going. Um, then Far Reach, you can actually like use it as almost like a swing or like a pull to take you somewhere where you wouldn't normally go with Blink. But Blink is a little more precise, whereas Far Reach is a little bit more like Mm, you might land here, you may not. Gonna mono while underwater. Care about that one. I do want that rune though. It, what else is here? Is there literally just this rune? Cool, let's just grab that. Quick save. This is a bad idea. This is where I needed to go, but that room. Oh shit, get up here. Yeah, I like the fact that Fire Reach is pretty much just like pull when Dowd had it. Like I really I really do enjoy that uh it's like pull. That's what I really like about it. And that you can grab items. And I can see why it would be a little probably a little bit easier to do a low chaos run on Emily. Because of her ability to do that. And avoid confrontations when needed. So, uh like with the the overseer building in the first the first time I played this, with the overseer building, um, I was able to pretty much completely avoid that one encounter with the guys on the street, thanks to um, thanks to using far reach. Oh my body. <laughs> rats. A box labeled rats. That's clever. That's that's ten out of ten. Okay. Wait, where's the black market? Oh shit. Did I lose the black market? Oh fuck me. Where's the where's the market? Yo, why doesn't it show me where the black market is anymore? That's fucking disturbing. That's just really dis- That's super disappointing. Oh, here it is. Can I go through here using- Oh wait, no, it's barred up. I can't go that way. Yeah. I really hate that it doesn't like leave it labeled for you. Greetings. I serve I don't know you. I'm new to Karnaka. 
I need a tool that can rewire a wall of light, the kind the Grand Guard uses, and I'd prefer not to explain myself. I can help you out, but not right now. Don't even linger here. I'm supposed to get a visit from Paolo, someone you don't want to meet. Come back later. Understood. You should go. We can do business another time. Like I said, Paolo is coming by. I think he's here. Hide yourself. deal too. But I'll make it up to you, Paolo. Pop off maybe 10%? 30. Because I like you. By next week. That's fair. I made a bad faith trade and I regret it. You'll have the cutters, I promise. Good, good. These are strange times. Overseers in the Dust District, a witch empress, and these clockwork soldiers protecting the aristocracy. All bad for business. But if I get my way, Karnaka will be a different city a year from now. I sleep in the shop most nights. The sit welcome. It's too late to run. I'm begging you, hide until Paolo's gone. He'll hurt you. Hmm. This is what I have yeah, for okay. upgrading your equipment. I did. <laughs> she was like, hey, there's some he's someone you don't want to meet, so I'm like, why not? You beat him in his hours. Well see, I don't my thing is don't tell me. Blind playthrough, remember. I feel like he's more useful to me alive than dead. Because remember, if you play Dishonored One, uh Slackjaw, if you help Slackjaw out, he helps you out. So, I feel like I want to take advantage of that. Okay, I don't want any more upgrade, but I do need gear. A pleasure to do business. were so much better just a decade ago. Could use the rewire tool or I could just grab like... Yeah. I really just wanted to grab some other stuff. I wish I had more money. 
I wish you could sell. I wish you could sell stuff. That just kind of irritating. But okay. Uh, so I have two runes again. Let's increase. What I wanted to do. Mm, I could have used Domino. That would have been a nice one. Perhaps I want to reload that. Did it just save it a moment ago? I guess it just saved it a few moments. Let's uh, do this autosave. And I will quick save it here. I don't want to use it on Shadow Kill, because if Shadow Kill, I can use it with something better. You should go. We can do business another time. Like I said, Paolo is coming by. Lock it down. This won't take Hide yourself. Oh my goodness. I'll see you if you try to leave. Find a place to hide and we'll do business afterwards. Wow, okay, really? Why do you do this to me, game? Why do you why do you do this? Why can't I just like Let me let me fucking let me fucking live my life here. Make sure we have some bread. <coughs> I should have spat right in his eye. That's what I should have done. Next time, for sure. Cutters, short blades, the good stuff. Morley steel. I know what you mean. Do you? Because last time you gave me some backwater foundry garbage that wouldn't hold an edge and snapped against Grand Guard armor. I got taken on that deal too. But I'll make it up to you, Paolo. Lop off maybe 10%? 30. Because I like you. By next week. That's fair. I made a bad faith trade and I regret it. You'll have the cutters, I promise. Good, good. These are strange times. Overseers in the Dust District, a witch empress, and these clockwork soldiers protecting their aristocracy. All yeah, I had to reload places. because I wanted to use the room on something else. Karnaka will be a different city a year from now. I'm gonna save the rune to unlock Domino. Slackjaw and Granny Rags. I saved Slackjaw and then I killed Granny. If you're not with the guard, I'm happy to serve. Okay. Let's see. I have some upgrade plans for your gear. You won't be sorry. in the Empire has driven the prices up, I'm afraid. A pleasure to do business.
Let's grab that. These were so much better just a decade ago. Grab more of these. Could use the money. Keep to the shadows. That's my advice. I'm gonna quick save that. Okay, so now I've got to get courage. Fell down. Yeah, like I'm, I'm hoping that uh, he'll be a recurring character. We shall see. That's not what I meant to use, but okay. A random guy. Is that a beggar? You, you look like you're doing pretty well. Appreciate it. I'll let you in on a secret. I saw people coming and going recently, looking for whale oil, up to something. You watch yourself. Grand guard are too friendly to stranger. I'm fucking mad. Where the fuck did this even put me? Did I actually get up here? Okay. I was gonna be real upset. Gonna be real fucking mad. Alright, so gotta go that way. Yeah, just, it's fine. Just fall and hurt yourself. Can you put me on top of this tree or no? Oh my gosh.
Okay. I got, got, I'm trying to remember how I got up here. So I got there. No, I apparently did not. I apparently did not get up this. Here we go. Alright, everybody's dead in here. Now I just gotta get to the ticket booth. It's a wonderful place. What the fuck is that? Bill little tank dispenser. Oh, okay. I shall take this. Sonic casing. Oh, okay. One of the booth keys has been stolen again. This time I'm not having it remade, so you have to share the remaining key. Hippo, when your shift is over, just wait for Narciso, Narciso to arrive, then hand the key to him. Narciso, you wait for Daniel, and so on. Nobody leave the key in some stupid hidey hole or whatever. The last key is lost or stolen, we won't be able to open the booth and you'll be all out of work. If you're worried, pull your coin and have another key made. Or go buy the old one from the black market, as I'm pretty sure that is where it is now. Tank stuff looks so different. Yeah, it does. It looks a lot better than in the first game. The first game, it looked a little bit, like, weird. To say the least. Just for shits and giggles. Mm, it still looks kind of like... Weird. Oh fuck. There I go. Time to leave. Delilah Caldwin. The upper district. You know, aside from the blood flies, this is a pretty beautiful place. You know. Without the I blood flying part. Jim Dosh's mansion from here. The gate's down. I'll need the code. Alright. 